So we're here at the IC Realtek. Who are you? Hello. I'm Ivan Onuchin. I am a product development engineer and uh, so I'm here to represent our new cameras. And you make these cameras, these uh, interesting designs. What's going on? What is this? Oh, each camera. Each camera it has a two lens. Each lens, they back to back, and each lens is kind of fisheye. So it captures a little bit more than whole hemisphere. And at some moment, the two hemispheres, they start interlapping, overlap each other, and we merge these videos together. How do you merge? Uh, so they have a special software Secret. stitching algorithm. Yes, this is kind of like our so IP. it's merging the pixels. It's uh, merging the two images together in one continuous video image. Is it perfect merge? It is a perfect merge at certain distance. Of course, there are parallax effects, but it's uh, technical. Stuff. Does that mean this is 360 cameras? Oh, uh, it's uh, it's not 360. It's uh, 360 by 360 in any direction. It's 360 by 360. It's everything. It captures All everything. All the way down. Virtually no blind spots. A little virtually bit under it, right? A little virtually no blind spots. Yes, every camera has its own impact of blind spot. But so this is not no blind spot 360. Uh, 1080p or what? Uh, or you don't do 4K, no? Uh, it is actually the final image. It, it depends on the camera resolution, but this image is about 4K resolution out stream currently. But, but we can do a 3K by 3K each sensor. So in total, it's going to be 18K. How many? 18 megapixels, sorry. 18 megapixels. 3K megapixel? by 3K, 18 megapixels of whole For camera. photo? For video. For video? For video. Yes, that 18... provides a tremendous resolution. We don't do 18 megapixel video. At this moment, we do not do, but at this moment, we do an 8 megapixel video, which is kind of 8K. Oh, for 4K image. 4K it's 4K. Image. Yes, it's, it's 4K. exactly 4K video. Exactly, exactly. Let me show, what let is me the... show you the real sample. So, here, for example, uh, let me select something. Now, let's say the onboard camera, which we done for Formula E. And you can see camera over there. It has uh, it has the two sensors on the side, and you can see everything around. You can see the car. You can see people around the car. This is us talking. So you can see you can see all the way up from there, from there, all the way down from the top of the yeah from this car. Around, this little, exactly, little thing exactly. there, and we are going around yeah. uh, with a video at 4K. This guy's there right by the camera. This is really high quality. Yes, yes. You can barely see stitching. The stitching is yeah, in the middle, right? Yeah, by the time right? we release the camera, we will change the lens. It will be more perfect at the uh, edge of the image circle. And it goes all the way down? All the way down, as much as possible. You can even possible. see the driver. You can see the driver. Let me show a different uh, video. This is actual. This is actual. Formula E footage that we capture in Uruguay. So the driver, driver, yeah, driver sitting here. But you can see again, so you can see all the way up, all the way down, literally any, anywhere. It's better to show you our interactive experience. So let's it's say crazy. you put the camera on a helicopter. Okay. In the cockpit on helicopter. You can see all the way up, all the way up to sky, all the way up to the earth. You can zoom in. Zoom out. You can see people in the cabin. So you always put the the cameras to the sides and have the split in the middle. Uh, or do for you... example, we integrated camera in the drone. If you fly in a drone, you almost do not see any 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 drone. So see the drone just started. You can see all the way up to skies. You barely see the leg of the drone and propeller. It's like your mind is flying. You don't have any VR headsets at the booth? Uh, we have VR headset in the booth, but uh, it's, I think it's not activated yet. So this, this like design this. like this? this what is, is the idea? This is more for baby monitoring. So they have so little rockets? This camera, it's the same idea, but the problem is that the baby is crawling around the room. And most of modern cameras, they cannot monitor baby everywhere. And our camera can see it everywhere. As well as the, our home model. It's like a drop cam, the same concept, but in comparison with a drop cam, it monitors all the windows and all the doors in the same time, if any movement happens. 
in any area in your room, any door, any window again. It but will the best send you a snapshot. The best way is to have a s small area as possible in between the two. You get a better image, no? Yes, then the parallax How will be less. How the smallest one you have? Smallest one? Uh, you can go, I think, up to maybe 30 millimeters between the lens. 13 millimeters? 30, 30. 30 Three millimeters? Zero. Yes. Uh, what is what is that about? Why do you oh, have these this is just for the demo. So we have uh, these uh, egg chairs, and we have a uh, beautiful girls which sit people there, and they start spinning them. This ah, it's spinning. Just to show it's interactive spinning. experience that we have in our with our cameras. That this style. So there is. This is the smaller one. This is one. the pro uh, pro model of our camera. Yeah. It has a little bit uh, more electronics and the better lens, better sensor, it will be occupied with IR and it has most important, it will have a much better software, much smarter analytics inside with the face recognition particularly and the other. What's the face image. recognition about? Face recognition it can uh, store the uh, database of people so the peop it, camera sees someone it can identify for example is this uh, person has appropriate access rights to access the certain territory or it can, can have a border crossing capability if someone cross the border then it, it can send a signal or so what what is your background my background you work for the, i'm actually the software engineer do you work I for the russian spice company spice company no 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 i no? never worked the best case i was working for russian academy of science the russian what academy of science that's cool so yeah and i was a teacher so how is this different from the other one, you have a Pro and a not Pro. Uh, pro has a better sensors, Pro will have a better lens, Pro will have a much better software with a special kind of analytic. So is it uh, one and nine dollar? This? No, no, no. This will cost a couple of uh, more than I think thousand dollars. We will see how much. So it's not so cheap. Uh, the price for Pro model is not identified yet, but the cheapest model will start from three ninety nine. Three ninety nine. Yes. Which design? Uh, I think it's, it will be in a baby monitor or home, early home, and a little bit more about the name of the camera. Uh, right. You know, in the past, people made uh, make photos of each other, yeah. then they start making selfie, like selfie. And later, we start making, when we make our camera, people will start doing Oli, Oli. This is the name of the camera, so the Oli. So what's uh, Oli? So what's the CPU inside? Secret? No, it's not secret. It's, it's Amber, Qualcomm yeah? Snapdragon Qualcomm. chip. Yes, really? that's why camera has integrated Wi-Fi. It has integrated all the, it's the same basic capabilities. That's why you do 4K. It's the same capabilities as your cell phone, and it can be even upgraded to 4G, having 4G model inside. So it will stream from any point. You're going on the beach, you put a camera on the beach, and it will guard your clothes. Let's put this way. <laughs> so that means you have 4G possibility, but we have a 4G possibility, Which one? but not this camera in this camera. Not for 399. Oh, yeah, of course you have to have a more advanced model. That's why I'm saying that the starting model will be 399. But more advanced model will cost more. And the uh, Formula One model? Formula E. Formula E is a new racing series which started in September. Uh, Formula E, it's an electrical racing car. Completely, they're coming to Miami, I think in March. Wow. And uh, they have a race this week in Brazil. Okay. Uh, so, we have our camera located on Coop. They have a, this week in Brazil? Yeah, yes, this week. In so you have to bring it to Brazil, this one? No, 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 no. This is the prototype that Qualcomm gave us. This is the one you have in your office? Yeah, this is the model. This is the model that Qualcomm gave us for the show. Because we partnered with them. It slows down a few, a little bit. Right? A what? Show? Slow down a little bit to have a camera, no? But every Formula E have a camera anyways. So uh, it's the same size as a Racing camera? cameras is totally different world. And the most important problem in the racing, uh, for the racing cameras is transmission. Because you have to transmit videos 
which is high beat rate and it's it's very very difficult in uh, uh, environment when the car moving fast a lot of people using different Wi-Fi devices different 4G devices so all the radio bandwidth basically occupied so the transmission problem is still remain but anyway we can do recording with uh, and keep this uh, for recording and for later review and let's see over here Today is showing inside. Yeah, this is a simplified Qualcomm inside. Snapdragon. Yes, Qualcomm 805. Snapdragon. Uh, this model currently has 800 chip, but the one which I show you, the little ball, will have 800, 805. 805, 810. Uh, 810, it's coming. So we are. I think we will release our camera early that 810 actually hit the market. Because 810 will do 4K H265. H265. Uh, Again, this is the tricky because it will do H.265 hardware accelerated playback, but not encoding. Encoding for H.265, they told me. Encoding, they told yeah, you encoding. Yeah, H.265. Interesting. We will look at this right now. More. It's only H.265 decoding on 805, right? But we need to do this for two sensors and two 4K sensors. I'm not sure it two. will be because yes, we have a two sensors in the camera. You cannot two, combine two. them into one 4K stream. Mm, then it's gonna be almost 8K, <laughs> which is. Uh, 3K and 3K is okay. I'm working in this area, I know it's hard. And also remember the amount of heat that is uh, yeah, producing uh, while the camera is encoding all these images. That's so why the camera will explode, will explode to do H.265 encoding. With, the, they told me it's lower heat because the mm, 805, it stops after five minutes when you record 4K because it gets too hot. Yes, yes. But hopefully yes. they fix it with 810. You have to apply some advanced uh, techniques to manage the heat. So you, you will have a limit in the length of the video? Uh, in fact, our cameras, they're working for several days without stopping. So we're doing the recording for several days, but we're using the special hardware to do this. Regular cameras, they will have an internal SD card, internal memory and SD card. So uh, if you're doing recording on SD card, it depends on the resolution. On, on the resolution and quality of bandwidth, I will show a couple more videos. Uh, Let's say this one, uh, it's uh, show the use case of party. You it's put, the most important. You put... Uh, you, I think so. For some Because you people. want to have a, a living room or a dinner table experience where you record the whole family. Everyone, everyone, yes. You can see what everyone is doing at which moment. With if the, something is stolen, position. you can easily find this. And uh, this is the most... most this is going to be the, the killer app. You need to have this always running in the middle of the family. So you can turn your head, you see the grandmother, you see everything, you know? Yes, yes, it's, it's very good. Another example Do you is... have it already at your home? Uh, no, I no? don't. So I how don't. has it been at CES? Oh, it was very, very busy. And what is important that all the major companies, they came to our booth. So we have got a lot of connections. And I believe that we, after the CES, we become 10 times more stronger from any position, from the business position, from the technical position, because many top-level companies, they're advising the help in um, the advanced different solutions. So now we can uh, do the 10 times more, 10 times more. And on the business side, I think the business people will tell you, but we also got a very good feedback. So what is the stage right now? The company is a new company? Uh, the company, it's I cannot for say this? it's new because uh, the you company has this? more than, uh, I think it's more than 10 years of experience in, in sur before? surveillance and okay. professional surveillance and security cameras. And the camera company, I see real time, which is the parent company for serial tech. It's selling the hundreds of thousand cameras every year. So, but it's a regular security cameras. Now we decided to touch the consumer market uh, with our new technology, new solution. And uh, so we've done the research for more than 10 years on the R&D side with the different, different technologies, including this one. So we have a very strong team of software developers and uh, hardware engineers, and we working with the major companies, as I said. Are the software developers in Russia? Uh, where? Not all of them, not all of them, but uh, core team. Uh, it's located between the United States, Russia, and... Uh, where in Russia? Where in Russia? Uh, I don't think uh, that people know this. It's not Moscow. Not Moscow. Not Moscow. All right. So somewhere in Russia, a bunch somewhere of guys. In Russia. Somewhere bunch of in guys. Russia. Bunch of guys. And uh, so I really would like to have a 360 4K camera uh, that just films from right here in my steady cam. 
uh, that'd be awesome if I had a 360 camera that streams 4G LTE, Live. 360. You can deliver that, right? Uh, With the long battery life, yes, I yes. Want because as I mentioned, life. as I mentioned, it, we got a lot of contacts. Now we also working on high definition, high quality video cameras for production. So we will do this for re really like a video production, guys. Like the good streaming even at the fair and have uh, a view around, see everything. You don't need to with a VR. Your camera yeah. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to. You can I'll do everything at once. But yeah. then the people will see you as well. It will be more like a live communication, I think. Like two people talking about and everyone can see each other at any moment of time. I have no problem uh, people seeing me, it's okay. <laughs>